max Q? Max Q is the period of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle that it will experience during flight due to the forces of thrust, gravity, and atmospheric pressure. Three, two, one. Engine ignition and liftoff of the Falcon 9 rocket nearly sunset as this Falcon 9 ascends from the historic launch complex 39A. Now 15 seconds into flight. Getting some great views from our tracking team here. Let's listen to the roar of those nine Merlin 1D engines. stage separation, second stage engine start, and then the beginning of the boost back burn, as again this booster is going to be making its way back down towards a landing at landing zone one. Here's some on view camera views from the Falcon 9 first stage. Some views from our tracker here on the ground. And our friend Pete Carsons with Max Q Productions. As you see, Miko. Stage separation. We're seeing the great shot of that flip maneuver here and the start of that boost back burn. Just incredible views from the ground. A little over three minutes into flight now. We should see fairing deployment in about 10 seconds on the SpaceX feed. Some great views from P. Carson's here. We did hear confirmation of fairing separation. No views of that today. Again, because of the sensitivity of some of the payloads on board. That boost back burn has ended. Those bursts that you're seeing, though, are the cold gas thrusters as the booster's attitude is being adjusted. Making its uh, arrival back on Florida's Space Coast. Coming up for a landing at landing zone one in just about three minutes. About four and a half minutes into flight. We're just about a minute away now from the start of the first stage entry burn beginning. So far, a nominal flight of the Falcon 9 first stage as well as the second stage. Some great views given the time of day and the sunlight really helping to illuminate the Falcon 9 first stage booster. A little over five minutes into flight now. There's the entry burn. Coming a little bit later in the timeline than what was previously advertised. No word from SpaceX that things are off nominal though right now. So it appears to have been a good entry burn.
a little over seven minutes into flight. According to the timeline, we should be coming up on first stage landings, so things happening just a little bit off from the advertised timeline. Now seven and a half minutes to flight, we should see the start of the landing burn shortly. Some great shots here, and there's the start of the landing burn. A little bit of a wider shot of that landing burn. Here's the same coming in from the SpaceX feed. 